Arcanites, and welcome back to another episode of Octopath Traveler 2. Now, before we get on into this episode, I want to say thank you to Square Enix for providing me with my copy of this game. However, we're going to go on ahead and warp over to Conning Creek because I want to start robbing everyone here. Out. No, um, we're gonna octopuff me. I have no clue what I'll an take. octopuff is. Or not? <laughs> oh, um. Discount at the end, and this is why you talk to everyone. chance to steal something I'm not really particularly caring about. Also, I robbed the other town while off camera. So everyone has a nice set of new items. For example, this conjurer staff for Thronies so the healing's better. Hey look, it's Particio. That was hey, Particio, close your eyes while I do this. Oh. Um, that might be pretty much oh, wait, no. Wait, partner? When did I steal from you? I'll take Doink. An item, nice. Doink. Another hidden item, nice. Plentiful provision. Ooh, nice. Nice! I'll take. What do you got to sell? Ooh, you're expensive. Kind of want to buy this. You know what? That's a big increase. That's all I need. Didn't we get new armor? Yes, we did. Holy crap, that's even better than... Before... You know what? You're hitting it. Alright. Um... Oh, there's more to the stone? Wait. 
Oh shit. This is... Yep. And this is where they studied. Alright. Let's actually get started on... Uh, in the moment, actually. Because first, we're gonna talk to her. Do you need something? Well, you better ask someone else. The apothecary said I'm very sick to see so pretty soon, all. He told me I need to be strong if I want to get better, but I can't stand that awful medicine, and everything hurts so much. My parents said there are things worth living for, but they aren't full of me. Oh, I can't give her medicine? Uh... Okay. Um... Journal? There it is. Side stories. Oh, that's it? Okay. No, I can't steal from the grandma visiting. Let's see if anyone's down here during the day. Quickly! To the tavern! And this time, not to reset our rep. What can I do for you? Prepare for the impending night of Scar the Scarlet Moon, a catastrophe that reoccurs once every 400 years. One creature alighted on Azure Sea, a wave like a mountain approached the shore, and threatened to swallow all that was there. The creature struck a blow of grief, the wave broke, tranquility was restored. The creature of legend that guarded that land was named Cataracta. Oh, wow! Wow! Oh, wow! It sounds as amazing as I thought! Oh, look at all this! Seafood. Seafood. <sighs> now let's see. Where might Cataracta be? Something tells me not in the town. Or is it that come, person? Come. There? Your eyes are wandering. Can I interest you in these fresh caught clams, young lady? Uh oh, food. Ooh, they look amazing. Uh, maybe just one. A pleasure. <laughs> huh? Is this jerky? <laughs> Freshly cured. You'll love it. Don't you have any uh, money? Money? You mean this? Exactly. <laughs> uh, say, is there some kind of festival on today? Huh. Festival? Isn't that why you're in costume? Those ears look so real. Uh. Yes, I'll take that as a compliment. Huh. Oh, Chad, did you hear that? Yeah. What is that noise? A voice? Someone crying. It's coming from over there. 
I just noticed that Chet has a wolf tail while the hunter class gives a, like, cat tail. At least to Agnia it did. Do you think it could be Cataracta? You never know. Let's follow the sound and take a look. Okay. Travel banter. Wow, look at all this fresh fish. Wish I could just share this with the folks back home. Should we stew it with some tomatoes or just salt and grill them? What do you think, Ochet? Munch munch. I think it's fine like this. A little funky, but definitely worth it. Ochet, I want to show you something. One moment. Well, what is this? Eh, <laughs> I just gave it a light saute. Try it with this sauce. Down the hatch. This food, it's unbelievable! It's so light and fluffy, the funky smell is completely gone. I'm glad you like it. I had no idea today's catch could taste this good. Maybe you should be the hunter, Aggie. Oh, oh, Chet. She was for a bit. Anything else? Okay. Oh boy. More people to steal from. Hang on a moment. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Hidden item. Oh. Sure, I'll give it a rest, see? I'm not doing nothing. Okay. Thank you. I see that item on the island all the way over there. Hi. Give me that. I'll take. Uh, I can't believe all my best fish have been stolen again. Damn thief! They just take and take when I'm not looking. But it's strange. I keep watch till the middle of the night, but don't, still don't see a thing. Just don't know what that sneaky thief has. When the sneaky thief has the time to take my fish. I can still hear it. Oh, apparently, turning at night sure causes. It right it's coming from that island. To the island. Mahina, you wait here. I'll swim there and back. Mahina can fly. You certainly will not. There's a wharf over that way. Let's take a boat from there. Uh, that does make more sense. Better not to tire myself out before I know what's out there. Am I gonna have to fight this thing? Get out of here. What? Who are you? Alpione, guardian of the waves, and I will not let you near that island. Oh yeah, and who's gonna what stop me? What manner of creature are you? I'm a hunter. Your scent is unusual, almost like some kind of beast. Not a bad nose you have there. No matter. Whatever you may be, you shall not pass. You shall not pass! P perhaps we should take our leave? We can't turn back now. Come on, let's provoke her. In a moment. Aren't you curious about that thief? Rainbow glass bottle. Also, I can't provoke during the night, now I think about it. Alright, provoke. Come on, then. You won't receive any mercy from me. <laughs> you surprised yourself. Here we go! Provoke. 
about that, but I really need to get to that island. Come on, let's go. There you go. But first, under soul stone. I'm not going up there just yet. We'll see though. My complaint so far with this game is it seems like it's the same issue as. Oh, before. Chet! So you were the one we heard crying. Uh oh. Are, it's dead. Are those. bones? From what? The wind coming in off the sea must have blown across them like a flute. Such a sad sound. You found Cataracta, I see. This is Cataracta? Hi. And whoa, you already came too? I can't believe I lost to a child. I must be getting rusty. You were pretty weak. But you're too late anyway. There's nothing left but bones now. Scales, whiskers, claws. Gone. Hmm. That doesn't seem good. Uh... I wasn't after any of that stuff. What? I'm from Totohaha. I came to get Cataracta. There's a calamity coming. But there's not much Cataracta can do dead. We'll have to make do another way. Let's go, Mahina. Wait. Huh. In years past, Cataracta was the guardian deity of this sea. Even if it has been so long that nobody in town remembers it. I want to show you something. What is it? I'm kind of curious. It's deep inside these caverns. I'll wait for you there. Okay, Alpione. Travel banter. Almost there. Hmm? You caught me. What's up, Nene? Why were you sneaking up on me? Nene, that name aside, how did you know I was there? Eh, you smell so good, how could I not? Even when you're hiding, I know you're there, and that you're up to something. Your nose is that sensitive? I'll be honest then. The truth is, I, well, was hoping to touch your tail. Say what? That fluffy tail of yours. I've had my eye on it for some time. Uh, sure. Really? Don't overdo it, though. It gets ticklish. 
Let's be honest, who wouldn't want to touch the tail? It is super fluffy looking. Okay. Let's... I don't know if that's a... I'm gonna say here. I can't remember if it was... That's an egg. <laughs> Let's play. Cleaning time. Um. <laughs> My turn. Uh, Max attack. Uh, there. It's my turn so. now. Oh shit! You're out of MP. Oh, why did I? Good. Ow. This is bad. Fight fair. My turn. What? Isn't that supposed to remove the positive effects? Get rid of the shadows. Ready? No sword. Now then. Nope. Well now. Beyond Cassie, jeez. My prey awaits. Yeah. Oh, you don't want to miss this. Yeah. Yeah. Goodbye. I know no cure for evil. Honestly, Throne doesn't need the speed. Cleaning time. Well, this is obvious. Or not. Go on then. Not lightning. It's my turn now. Dagger. My turn. Oh. to do that one. Slumber way 
save all. This is heal, right? Yeah. Honestly, I no, I need that for like provoke fights. That's been all. Yeah. We'll just start an integral chicken. My turn. Journey will not end here. Here we go. Up and around, grab the chest. Just a healing grape bunch. Nothing special. Alright. Nice! I'll take 6,000. You made it. Good. Sit. Hungry? Eat this. Anchorfish. Oh god, you said the magic word, food. That's life for you. Every living thing devours life. Simply to stay alive. Huh. But okay. humans are ugly. They kill out of avarice and greed. You mean Cataracta was killed by humans? Oh shit. I remember it well. One second. I just need a better view on. OBS Cataracta here. was still weak after saving the town from a great wave. And then, the Dark Hunter appeared. The Dark Hunter? A single hunter who killed Cataracta. What a coward. My people came to the Guardian's defense, but only I survived the battle. The hunter took Cataracta's life and then left. <sighs> Greed soon brought others to the fallen god. Humans swarmed the remains like flies. They took everything, stripped it to raw bone. You'd think they'd take the bone, too. Why would they do that? Cataracta's scales and whiskers were worth more than the finest jewels. They did it for money. Hmm. Cowards! Mm, I prefer meat myself. <coughs> I'll be honest. Can I have another one of these? You already are. Try this, Mahina. <laughs> You're a strange one. I feel oddly as if I were speaking to a beast. Because I am. <laughs> uh, we're called beastlings, actually. Beastlings. Yes, I have heard that word before. Tales of a corner of the world where a race blending man and beast resides. Only tales, though. You are the first of your kind I have ever seen. Hmm. Hmm. An unusual texture. <laughs> that tickles! <laughs> anyway... Beast or human has never mattered much to me. What <laughs> matters to me now is whether I can have another one of those.
Oh, Chet, you're a glutton. Maybe I can trust you with it after all. Huh? Uh, trust me with what? You'll see. Well, there's an egg over there, so I assume that's what you're talking about. I wanted to steal from her. Is this? Cataracta's An egg. egg. Cataracta laid it just before dying. A final bequest. But the hunter been safe in my care ever since. Never showed signs of hatching before. Must have been waiting for this moment. Huh? Will you warm it for me? Cataracta knew death was near, and bore this child to fulfill her duty instead. Am I gonna have to give up a monster slot for it? Her duty to save your village. in the shell. I knew it. Hmm. Wow. 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 <gasps> it's cute. <laughs> it hatched. Meow. Meow. It meows? Take it with you. It may be some use against that calamity you mentioned. Uh, cool. It's cute and all, but it doesn't look very strong. That is the child of Cataracta. I assure you it will make a powerful ally. So I'm gonna have to give up I'm slots, sure I'm it'll assuming? Get stronger, I'll chat. Let's adopt it, okay? Can we? about you? What do you want to do? It's a dangerous journey. Sure you want to come along? Yeah. Okay then, if you're sure. Welcome to the team. No. Hmm. Have you decided on a name for it? I was yeah. wondering about that. Acta. Mew, mew. Huh. I think that name pleases it. I can tell it has found a good home. Is she like a ghost or something? Don't worry. I'll help it grow up big and strong. Thanks for keeping it safe until now. Now, I can finally lay my burden down. Uh, Alpione? Just the salt breeze in my eyes. Take care of your new charge. May fortune smile on you both. We'll come back to visit sometime. Once it's all over. Okay, so it doesn't look like we're gonna be... The chat finds the creature of legend, Cataracta. Or so, or at least her child. Alas, Cataracta herself is no longer among the living, and her child too young to fulfill its ancestral mission. But if Chet's spirit remains high as she continues her journey, somehow she knows it will all work out. Oh, Chet the Hunter, Chapter 2, Cataracta's Row, End. That was shorter than I was expecting. Okay, so Cataracta is just... 
actor, I should say. Hmm. Okay. Well, we've got some other chapter twos to work on. We've been here, right? Yeah. We have, I don't think I've been there yet. We have been here. There's so many different options. I can go to Winterbloom for Brona. I guess we can do the Mother's Route one, because it's level 7, yeah. Throne A, and then... You know what? Let's do it in the order we got them. I, however, like I said, I'm going to be doing... Uh, one skills. Oh, we can't, because we... It'd be lit up if we could. Where's the tavern again? There it is. Okay, yeah, we completely robbed this town already. Yep. Okay. Your tail. Throw a mother's row. Can't be too long, right? When Mother is looking for new recruits, she goes to the Saddlery in Oars Rush. Saddlery? It's common knowledge in the nest, though no one really knows why. What's and the it's Saddlery? It's the only clue I have. Now, to find that Saddlery. <laughs> that way. How do you know? Who's this? Hmm. Hey, you see that creepy kid? Oh, the saddlery. I see. Thank you for your patronage. I shall prepare the goods post haste. In the meantime, Please wait at the tavern. Hmm. Hmm. Might I help you find something? We have an array of goods made of cloth and leather and even others with chains. I'm not here for horse gear. But... Milady, this is a saddlery. Is that so? What did that man purchase just now? He didn't seem to have a horse with him. <laughs> you have a keen eye, Milady. Alas, that man did, in fact, bring a horse. I saw it with my own eyes. I would not be able to craft the proper gear otherwise. Did he now? Please, come again. As I suspected, it isn't a saddlery at all. As for this horse... It must be what I need for the exchange. Which means that man from before has one without a doubt. Let's go murder him. I suppose it's time to see a man about a horse. Travel banter. Hmm? What's this scent? Notice to have you. It's my perfume. It has a very bewitching scent. It suits you. Thank you. Would you like some? Eh, thanks, but I don't use perfume. 
I need my notes for when I concoct, concoct medicines. And there are patients who are sensitive to smells too. I see. You usually don't wear perfume either. It complicates work sometimes. But today, I need a little pick-me-up. I can tell your job is very important to you. Best of luck, Brownie. Thank you, Casty. Best of luck, stealing. The relief of a horse, so this is what he meant. I'd better make my way back to the saddlery. You know, for a thief, you're not very good. That guy, I mean. Back again, I see. Saddle up. I've brought my horse with me this time. Hmm. Ah, so you have. Which means I can finally treat you like a customer. <laughs> you sure don't make things easy for your clients. Aye. For mine is a very exclusive business. Now, what are you after? Mother mm. of the Black Snakes. She's one of my best customers. Your request is beyond my power. Well then. Good thing it's not a request. <laughs> nice. Mother is meeting a man I introduced her to. They call him the Slaver. Oh, I'm going to kill him. He runs the slave trade and is doing business in the town's old foundry right now. Foundry? I see. Is that the... To reach him, you must know these words. Drink from the cup in your left hand. Remember them well. Hmm. Thank you. Drink from the cup in your left hand. Be prepared. I doubt his lips will be as loose as mine. Lives may be lost before he is willing to talk. A small price to pay. Finally, someone... Like, so many people out for revenge, and yet... Can I steal anything? Ooh. Anyone want to equip that? Not at all. Okay, we're, we're set. The foundry, huh? <sighs> Have I been back here? Why does that kid look like the... I'm still being murderer? followed. They've been trailing me since I arrived. Oh, good. I'd you better noticed. get rid of them. Hi. Come on then. Oh wait, I should have probably looked at his. Right.
Good job. Oh. Like find out whether you like it or not. Oh. I'm through playing games. That face. Imagination? Not that it matters. Wait. Is Thronies going to be like this. clones? I must find that slaver. your head with your right hand drink from the cup in your left hand you may pass hmm <sighs> black begins choose a cup Your turn. White, drink now. This reminds me of uh, Illusion of Gaia. Looks like someone owes me 80,000 leaves. Damn it. I can't believe I lost. Hmm. All right. Who's next? Bring him in. It looks like they're gambling. You're first. Choose a cup. Are these slaves? <laughs> No, I don't want to. It was probably no the one on the right. At all, that one. No wonder I couldn't find a buyer for him. No one knows which cup the poison's in. That's what makes it fun, right? I haven't seen you here before. You're the slaver, I presume? I am a buyer and seller of slaves. So, what sort of merchandise are you looking to buy, young lady? Hmm. A woman named Mother of the Black Snakes. <laughs> A dangerous customer you are. Perhaps this is the day my luck runs dry. <laughs> is she here or not? You're too late. She already left. Damn. I can't tell you where she's gone. Without the proper compensation, that is. Now I see why this is level 7 though. You carry a delectable scent. Oh, you're creepy. It's the smell of shore flowers. Do you like it? It isn't the flowers I'm interested in, but the smell of sweat beneath them. Even the most disciplined are exposed by their own scent. Humans are overcome with fear before their demise, 
and their sweat reeks something awful. But your scent is still sweet. There's no fear in you. Interesting. But what does that mean for me? I will tell you where Mother went, if you can best me. A man after my own heart. No, I don't stand a chance in a fight. Aww. We will do battle here. At death's table. Wait, am I gonna choose which cup or something? Oh. No. I heard they put on an interesting show here, but I wasn't expecting this. The one at the table is our boss. Uh, I hate cleaning duty, but I guess these corpses won't remove themselves. Do they got anything interesting on them? <laughs> Ready to sit at this table? Sure. You look like you've made your peace. Let's begin. You saw the game before, didn't you? Are you afraid? No, I will gladly accept your challenge. Of these six cups, one is filled with poison. We will take turns drinking. The one who drinks the poison loses. I wonder if this is... Are there any other rules? If you try to run, you die. That's all there is to it. The slavers never lost a game. She doesn't stand a chance. I will begin. Hmm. It appears my cup was safe. Now it's your turn, young lady. The poison is lethal. Drinking it means certain death. Okay, so it's not going to have me choose. But not a merciful or swift death, no. Release will come only after what feels like an eternity of agony and excruciating pain. That's fine with me. It will give you time to tell me where Mother went before you perish. Ha <laughs> ha <laughs> Your false courage won't spare you from the pain. I mean, you said you already know she... Well, well. It looks like my cup was safe, too. <laughs> but my compliments on the liquor. In fact, I think I'll have another. Ah, <sighs> exquisite. Oh. What's with this woman? <laughs> this is the first time I've ever seen someone down two in a row. There was no rule saying I could only have one, was there? Ha <laughs> ha, I see. So you're a snake. Just like me. Is that so? I know the stench of imminent death better than most. And yours will reach my nose before long. You gonna drink or what? There are two left. It's your turn. The one on the left is gonna be safe, right? I do not fear death. I could even accept dying here. The only thing I fear is giving up on what I want. Oh. <laughs> Gee, I wonder which one I should choose. Which is why I'm willing to bet everything on my dream. Thanks for the drinks. I can detect even the faintest scent of poison. I always dodge the tainted glass. Leaving it for my opponent. Then couldn't you have won? Ha! I wanted to test you, but it looks like my curiosity got the better of me. 
You have bested me. I feel like I should have done the death. He drank the last glass. But that means... Yes, Captain I Obvious. I will tell you where Mother went. As promised. She hides in Wellgrove. Wellgrove. In a place called Mother's Garden. It's officially an orphanage and has the support of a local monastery. But it's where she raises her hatchlings for the nest. <sighs> you could probably sneak in as a nun. Farewell. So we're gonna steal nun clothes? The war of snakes repeats itself over and over again. I couldn't cut myself loose either. The former head wouldn't let me. The former head? She was a good woman too. But she was killed by mother. I hope you find what you seek. Thank you. You're the one from before. I know your face. Throne. Yeah. Let's go. It's time for Mother's punishment. Hero. That's his name. I completely forgot it, not gonna Looks lie. Just like Piro when he was little. I feel like we've met before. So do I. I felt like you're someone important. That's why I followed you. What's your name? Would your father happen to be named Piro? I don't know who my father is. Hmm. Neither do I. Perhaps we have some things in common. Goodbye. Throne to discover his mother's location. Along the way, she wagers her life in a game against a slaver and meets a young boy with a familiar face. The solitary thief draws nearer to the truth of the black snakes. Throne continues her journey, awaiting the day she will walk free. Throne the Thief, Chapter 2, Mother's Route, End. Wait, am I gonna have to go do Father's Side 2 or something? Chapter 3, Mother's Route. Oh, you chose! Oh no, there it is, Father's Row. Okay, I'll remember that. Winter Bloom Row. Glossius Row. Okay. Do I have a chapter 3 anyway? For... No! Okay. Looks like I have to go do all the her chapter two before I can do her chapter three. Yeah. Yeah, it's weird. Alright. Oh, treble banter. That man had a pretty good nose. It's rare for humans to have such a keen sense of smell. Perhaps he was punished for abusing his good senses. You know, I kind of understand what he was saying. You have a unique scent. How can I explain it? It's sweet and sultry, I guess? Thank you. Is my scent really that strong? Alright, with that, Esconites, I want to say once again to thank you to Square Enix for providing me with my copy of this game. But, 
as always, Eskenites, hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. And remember, Eskenites, share the love. Goodbye!